if you've not the benefit of a professional wedding planner on your wedding day, I'd recommend you put together a bride's SOS kit. So, what's in the box? Well, first of all, I've included a lipstick or a lip gloss. This is essential for every bride on her wedding day and not just for the touch-ups for the official photographs, but also for those key photo opportunities such as the cutting of the cake and the first dance. A nail file, pop one in the box just in case. And when I'm talking about weddings, everybody wants me to talk about the pretty stuff, but we do need to think about the essential stuff. And it's essential on your wedding day that you are wearing a really good deodorant. I'd recommend Shore Maximum Protection. Put it on as soon as you've showered or bathed in the morning and it's going to last you right through the day, well into the evening, long after you've strutted your stuff on the dance floor. It really won't let you down. Now, wedding days are usually long days and you will want to be checking your hair every now and then, so you're going to want to have a hairbrush or a comb handy. Also think about having some hairspray. Good not just for taking care of those stray strands, but also for fighting the frizz in the event that it's especially warm or humid weather or damp weather. Next, a spare pair of tights. Really useful not just for yourself, but in case perhaps a bridesmaid or a mother ladders hers. I've also included some cleansing wipes or some tissues. These are really useful for the bride and the groom because on a wedding day, lots of people, lots of ladies wearing lipstick will be greeting you and kissing you on the cheek and you might need something to clear that away. Include a powder compact in your SOS kit. Really useful to shake off the shine for the official photographs. And don't be frightened to use a little bit on your groom if you think he's looking a little bit shiny across the forehead. Next, we have a sewing kit. This is the kind of sewing kit that you might get if you're staying in a hotel, but you can pick them up anywhere. And they include um, threaded needles and also spare buttons. And I've lost count of the number of times at weddings that I found myself sewing on a button for a groomsman, a father, or even the groom. Cotton buds, include these in your SOS kit. They're really useful for any number of bridal beauty disasters, not least if you need to fix some of the mascara that's run under your eyes in case you get a tad emotional. Do include some soda water to assist you if you get any little spills on your wedding dress because you really do need to be careful what you use on a wedding dress and soda water is a risk-free rescue remedy. And finally, you might want to include your favorite perfume in your SOS kit. So. Pop all these things into a box. It doesn't have to be a fancy one like this one. It could be a shoe box or a plastic container with a lid. And know where you've got access to your SOS kit all day, not just when you're getting ready. Happy wedding planning. <laughs>